And that's how I got addicted to eating mattresses. Thank you, Macy. I know, I know that's hard to share. Thank you. Bailey, would you like to share yours with us, please? Hi, my name is Bailey. Hi, Bailey. And I'm addicted to eating other people's hair. <laughs> Um, I've been addicted to eating hair since about the fifth grade. Once I went to a sleepover at my cousin's house and I saw her combing her hair and I thought, that looks delicious. Hey, I'm Natalie. Um, I'm the advisor for the PICA's Anonymous group. I've been doing it like four years now. Uh, PICA is the persistence eating of things without nutrients, so like dirt or hair. <clears throat> um, I'm a recovering addict myself, that's why I'm so effective. Hi, I'm Bailey's twin sister, Leah. I didn't know about her addiction until a couple years ago when I walked into the bathroom and she was eating my hair off of my brush. What? Is, is that my hair? Or, no, come here, give that to me, get it, get it. This has been a really great session, Bailey. Like, applesauce is so much better than hair. Thank you. Yeah. Have a, have a great night. Hit the lights on your way out. All right, I will. You know, we've tried a lot of different therapies for Bailey. We've done uh, talk therapy. So Bailey, how does that make you feel? It makes me feel sad. I see. And how does that make you feel? Do you know what? Just get out of my house! Uh, this is my house! The I forgot! It's my house. It's locked. Ugh. Electric shock therapy. Then we kind of went towards the more unconventional therapies. None of it worked. <laughs>